All right, we got some action today. We saw a total of about 12 deer. So at least we got something good to show you today. Maybe we get one. Who knows? We got to watch and find out. Brought Kevin's girlfriend out. Fuck you, Kevin. I'm meeting your girlfriend right now. Bullshit. Just when I was leaving hunting. On my way home. Them deer probably walked right past where I was. <laughs> yep. Yeah. At least they're all dough. Ain't no bug. Skunked. Nothing. Heard a lot of shots up top. Uh, that's where I was last night. Um, it was actually the stand I was going to go to. Um, that wasn't in a tripod stand, but it was up, you know, a couple hundred yards from there. Uh, that's where all the gunshots came from. Them, the other hunters here, they use uh, slug guns. Those are pretty damn loud. Make a lot more noise than this 350 Legend. But, um, yeah, nothing. These, the Orange Army done tore these deer up. I mean, you guys see me opening day, and even, you know, we had that little 60 degree weather a couple days ago. I was surrounded by deer. You know, opening day was nuts. That's hunting. That's kind of why I started this channel and doing these little vlogs so people can see, you know, what it's like to be a, you know, a real hunter, not, you know, somebody that hunts on a, like a fenced in farm. And these are 100%, you know, free chase here. They look at you right on the property line sometimes. You saw them buck and I shot them too and I went over there and there were actually more deer trying to come over. Um, that's the thing, sitting up here on this edge line. You know, and it's the other day when I had the 30 deer come on in. That's because I saw that buck there. I was hoping that buck was going to come join him. I kept looking back in the brush and everything. I couldn't believe that buck didn't come out with all those deer. I mean, I could have tagged out easily opening day, even if I didn't, you know, shoot all a couple deer during archery. I could have filled all them tags. A lot. That's hunting. You got to you gotta hunt where the deer are, not where you want them to be. I'm not even trying to be like that guy from the hunting public shoots in front of the ground. I might get a ghillie suit and just sit there in my compound bow. <laughs> that or in this little corner here. I think that'd be a cool shot to do. Maybe I'll do that. Once I get my get one with my flint lock, I'm gonna ambush one with my compound. Yeah, I haven't hunted with that in a while. I got spoiled with that crossbow. I oh, know it's a cross going do do do. But it's here where you hunt. I mean, it's so it's such far shots here. The big woods, which I couldn't make it to because of my knee. There's a lot of like 20 yard and in shots you can get set up there, but that's out here. I mean, it's all just little tiny thickets surrounded by, you know, cornfields and pastures. That's only maybe 10 acres up there out of a couple hundred, you know, these woods. We got some venison. This is actually Kevin's girlfriend for when we're abroad, but. I'm hype as shit right now because Taco Bell just came back out with the double decker. Well, why don't I restart that because then YouTube will ban me for playing Tupac because I don't have a license because I can't afford it because I don't have enough subscribers yet. I need more subscribers so I can buy the YouTube license so I can play, you know, other people's music, but I'll try it again. Maybe I'll use that one. We got Kevin's girlfriend to eat when we're afield and <laughs> Taco Bell just came out with the double decker again they stopped making this time honored tradition now if only McDonald's will bring back the snack wrap you know don't let me become present because that's what I'm doing but uh yeah anyway it was just snowing we're gonna go out here and hunt see what happens just get us a deer this is the struggle we embrace the struggle, the grind. We're hunters, this is what we do, you know. We overcome perseverance, you know, feast or famine. Can't always shoot deer every day, that's why it's called hunting. We got a couple of doe bedded behind us, about 200 yards or so. Um, but wind's blowing that direction. You already know they come in there, so. As long as they come in early, they're not going to get my wind. A lot of times they come behind me. That would be 
even more ideal. But, uh, yeah, brought Kevin's girlfriend out. Have a little snack. Fuck you, Kevin. I'm meeting your girlfriend right now. So, stay tuned. I might get a shot for you guys tonight. Patience is key to hunting. You pick up a lot, you know, just by archery hunting. I can just tell by the aneurysm of that first deer. You know, it kept looking back. A lot of times when we're looking back, there's another deer. Oh, here you go. Just more and more keep on coming out. That's why, you know, let them get nice and close to you. Try and watch them. Sometimes you're wrong. You should have just took that mistake, but you never know what's behind them. So, so you always got to be aware of all your surroundings. And you'll see up here, you know, they're looking back once they get close to me. Something was spooking them behind me. I looked back. I couldn't see another deer at all. Um, might have been a coyote or a fox. I didn't see one of them either, but that'd be my guess. It was some type of predator because they were looking to the side of me, stomping, carrying on. I don't know what the fuck that was about. This is Kevin, that dumbass deer I keep telling you about. You can't make this up. This deer follows me everywhere. This deer drives me nuts. I double checked him to make sure he didn't grow three on one side since the you know two days it's been since I've seen him. This deer got to go. Next year, if he's this dumb, somebody's going to plug his ass. He'll be done. Can't make this up, seriously. If I had these cameras at the beginning of the season, you'd have seen this deer so much. You'd be sick of them too, like I am. This is nuts. That's it. Got Kevin and one of his bitches over there. Can't make this shit up. Kevin is always fucking me. Always. I mean, I fucked myself when I was taking that 120 yard shot, but I couldn't get my leg up on this rail and click lean on my knee. It was just, it was an octopus shot. Hit her up there. Looks like they're actually walking towards me. I'm just gonna slip out of here. 
walked a long way out. Leave my same ground set in case I come here tomorrow, but I think I'm going to go up the road. I'm going to get one in two days. I had to double check and make sure that Kevin didn't have three on one side because he was about to go. That was Kevin. Can't make that shit up. The Tacticam. I don't know what the hell's going on with that thing. I, uh, I had it on. 